Hey, what is up guys, this is Jack with 11 and welcome back to another video. And today we're going to be discussing if Black Friday is going to happen or not. Because Black Friday is in three days. It's currently Tuesday when I'm recording this and when I'm uploading this, hopefully as well. Yeah, you. So, we didn't really know anything about Black Friday as of yet. I'm just going to go through what we already on my predictions or what we got last year because I'm pretty sure we're getting somewhat the same as last year so yeah last year we got the galactic skins we got galactic hats galactic torvo galactic barrel galactic gallimimus we've got galactic uh, thalostromatus I'm pretty sure um, I don't think there's more galactic skins, the galactic prognathodon maybe as well, yeah? So all the galactic skins definitely. We got the movie skins as well, movie brachiosaurus, movie spinosaurus, movie triceratops, they were all viable, right? And then we also got the kaiju, the kaiju quets, the kaiju sauroposeidon, the kaiju barry, the kaiju titano, and the, not, not the kaiju spino, I was just about to say kaiju spino, I don't know why. And then, um, yes. A lot of people apparently didn't watch that video, so I'm gonna just say it again. Hybrids are not coming back to Black Friday, by the way. They are never coming back, which is a real shame for new people. Because it, it really is a hell, to be honest, to trade up what's in value. Because nobody will accept buyables when you only have buyables. Nobody will accept a buyable for a, a rare skin of some sort. But to all of you guys that have been trading trying to trade for kaijus and movies and only have buyables this is your chance to buy a lot and by the way there is a trick to buy multiple of one dinosaur so I, I, I'm gonna just say that as well now so you go into onto the game right you buy a skin then you go into trading and convert it into your inventory your trading inventory and then you go back to the game again and you can buy it again and stock up on rare skins but the thing is you guys gotta notice and keep this in, this in mind. When you buy these rare skins, there becomes there comes more rare skins into circulation in the trading. So, kaiju skins will not be rare. They will basically be like buyables. That that's kind of like the thing. So don't expect your trading value to go up and being able to trade for giant albino baryonyx or mega wars. That's kind of like the whole premise of it. So do not expect your trading value to go up. Only buy them if you think they're cool because they're not gonna get you anywhere if you just waste all your DNA buying 10 of them or something. Only buy them if you think they're cool, alright? That, that's just my suggestion for you, I guess. But alright, to the Black Friday thing, is it gonna happen or not? So, short answer, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and keep it short, obviously. So, Black Friday is happening. Chicken Engineer confirmed it, like, a little time ago. I'm gonna just check real quickly. It was... Saturday, so it's Tuesday today, so three days ago, roughly. Three days ago, he uh, confirmed that there's going to be the annual Black Friday event on uh, Dinosaur Simulator. And as we also know, there's been a lot of flipping remakes. Like, I'm pretty sure they have at least 10 remakes stocked up on new things. There's also been some things with like the Tyranno Titan remake being animated. So it may just be released along with all of this. And we've got Halloween skins as well. We got the Wraith Terra, the Shonosaurus remake, the Brachiosaurus remake. We got a bunch of stuff for this upcoming update. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna be awesome, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be awesome. Like a lot of updates. And who doesn't like updates? Like, at least for me. I'm really stoked for the Patosaurus and Brachiosaur remakes. And then, yeah, Tyranitide remake is actually pretty darn cool as well. I I'm not gonna lie. Most of Jeffinette's models are really cool, but sometimes they're not that cool. I don't like the Mapu um, color scheme, for example. But I think the Tyranitide color scheme is way cooler being green and yellow. So that's kind of like my thoughts about it. And obviously we're also maybe getting some sort of Halloween map. I don't know. Maybe a winter map instead. You, you, you never know if Vendigo King has been working on anything in particular. I, I, I'm currently using Santa Claus. And you could get Santa Claus on the um, winter map I'm pretty sure. Or else it was viable. I cannot actually remember. So yeah. I don't think I have more to say than that. Other than yeah. We also have the Gren Grenil map. Grenell map, if, if you guys know that, if you're hyped for the Grenell map, I have no idea if you are hyped for that, but I sure am. I basically, like, the things I'm most hyped for, 
I don't care at all about Black Friday. None of the skins that come out on Black Friday are cool. Like, yeah, of course you guys may think they're cool. Of course I already have them, but I don't think they're special. They're not fun to use. I'd, I'd rather have dinosaurs, not kaiju giant monsters on a dinosaur game. So I don't really care about Black Friday, like, at all. Because it's the same every year. There was one year when we had hybrids. And we have not had hybrids for Black Friday ever since that. They, they, the hybrids, they were... Um, on Black Friday 2016, as you guys may know, um, Albino Terra was released, or Indominus Rex that it was referred to back then, was released in um, on June. No, yeah, June 10th of um, 2015, and that's around when I joined. I joined late May, I think, late May, um, on Dinosaur Simulator. So just I joined right around when uh, Indominus Rex was released, and then um, Black Friday 20. 2016 again, yeah, it was uh, renamed to Albino Terra, and Megavore became a thing at that Black Friday as well. So it was the first time that Megavore could be bought, but the thing is, people could have gotten Megavore for free as well. Because I actually got Megavore for free, because there was this skin called Isisori Raptor that you could unlock with a code on the, the classic game, you know, and it was a skin for the T-Rex. And once this Megavore came out, this skin was transformed into a Megavore. So basically, a bunch of people got Megavore for free. And yeah, to those still curious, if hybrids are coming back, they are definitely not going to be the original prizes. As I've stated numerous times, it's all up to Chicken. Chicken has never said that hybrids are not coming back. It's the uh, developers. But as we know, Chicken is the owner and the lead developer. So the lead developer, not the lead, what I'm saying. So it's up to him in the long end, and we we don't know what's gonna happen. We don't know what's gonna happen with that. He may just end up releasing them, not caring what the developers say, because I mean, as I already said, it's so hard for people to trade up in value. And I know how you guys are feeling trying to trade up for hybrids, etc. It's really hard, and Black Friday is not gonna help you. I can assure you that much. You need limiteds, and Black Friday dinosaurs or skins are not limited. That's kind of like the whole thing about it. But I'm not going to keep talking for any longer. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And yeah, as I said before, Black Friday is coming. I can also give a date, actually, to those that stay to the end of the video. Thursday, 8 p.m. U.S. Eastern Standard Time. So that's the that's the time. That's when it's going to be live. So I hope you guys enjoyed, alright? I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.